hello everyone uh, here we are going to solve this question which is uh, calculating the entropy change so for entropy during a phase change and enthalpy change occur means uh, there is a change in uh, temperature or change in energy happen at a constant temperature here the information is given water vaporize at 100 degrees celsius means water boils and convert into vapors and the change in energy is delta h vapor is equal to 40.67 kilojoule so we have to calculate the change in entropy for one mole of water when water vapor condense at 100 degrees celsius so we have to find out the change in entropy at uh, for condensation of water so we have to use this formula and uh, delta s is equal to q upon t so where is t is temperature in kelvin and con we have to consider the sign of delta h for the change so before solving this pre question let's uh, talk about the entropy so what is the meaning of entropy entropy means disorder means uh, randomness of a molecule so if we are going to talk about the three phases of matter like a solid liquid and gases phase solid molecules have very less freedom to move around or disorder like compared to liquid and gases phase has the highest disorder so if we are talking about the water so ice is the best example of solid which has very less entropy because their molecules are very less disorder they are not in very much random compared to water and vapor steam so steam has or vapors have very high disorder therefore entropy of steam will be higher than ice or water so let's understand this uh, phase change in this uh, graph if we have uh, entropy on the y axis and temperature on the x axis so this will increase from left to right and entropy will increase from 0 to up so there are three phases solid liquid gas if we will increase the temperature of a solid or ice it will start converting melting and it was at this phase it will melt into liquid and then if you will keep increasing the temperature at certain temperature means for water 100 degrees Celsius it will start boiling so the change in entropy is increasing you can see from left to right we are going from solid to liquid solid to liquid and liquid to gas so entropy is increasing on the other hand if we will de go in the reverse direction basically if we will decrease the temperature of gas it will start condensate condensation and it will convert into liquid and if you will keep decreasing the temperature it will certain mm, temperature around zero degrees celsius it will start freezing right so from gases phase to liquid phase entropy decreases and from solid phase to gases phase entropy increases so we will use this concept to solve this uh, question so here is given delta h for vapor vapors is given plus 40.67 kilo joule per mole and delta h for condensation will be exactly same but sign will be negative because 6 7 kilo joule per mole so if you will see the energy or temperature required to boil the water exactly same energy you will get once you will con condense condensation once you will do condensation of water gas into water for the same amount of water so we know the condensation because in the question they are asking 
what will be the change in entropy for the condensation of water so we have to change the sign here and now delta s is equal to q upon t so temperature is given here 100 degrees celsius which will be equal to 100 degrees plus 273 if once we will add then it will convert into kelvin so 373 degree kelvin and uh, number of moles of water is given one so we will modify this formula a little bit in such a way so this q is change in energy or change in enthalpy basically we, it's the same thing so we can write delta h and temperature but we have to multiply with the number of moles also so delta h is uh, given in this equation for vaporization vaporization of water is given and but they are asking in the question it is asking water vapor of condensation so we have to use minus sign for condensation 40.67 number of moles is equal to 1 divided by temperature which is 373 kelvin and the units if we will use this one here so kilo joule and using this small k for kilo joule per mole and one mole of water and this k big k is for kelvin temperature so mole mole will be cancelled and then once we you will solve this so 40.67 divided by 373 and the answer will come 0 0.10903 and we have to use minus sign and unit will be kilo joule per kelvin we can also write this minus 109.03 joule per kelvin so change in enthalpy will be equal to 109.03 kilo joule, joule per kelvin and this is the way we have to calculate change in entropy for phases if basically if uh, energy or delta h is given for boiling you have to just use the same value but sign will be change plus to negative we will solve another question in the next video